uh, came in about 10 o'clock at night and the cook always had a, a bucket of black tea for us to have a re refreshing drink, you know, and it'd been drizzling rain all day. And in the camp they'd draw, dug out a big dugout to let the water rain down into the, into the river. And it was my turn to get it, of course, barefooted. And as I was coming back with it, it was an old bucket. My foot slipped. I threw the bucket and the whole lot came down on that leg, both of them. And they were just blistered from top to bottom. Uh, didn't wait, waited till morning when the sick parade was on. Poor Gernot Dunlop had a look at him and uh, he didn't say anything. And uh, anyway, the, I don't know, it was them and big tablets or what it was, but I know they put, but they couldn't bandage, we had no bandages, so I just have to stay there with them like that. But the point about it was, if you got a little cut on your leg or anything like that, within about a week or 10 days, you had an ulcer like that, and I know they thought I was going to lose both my legs. They thought it was nothing sure. Three weeks that I was out, they'd, they'd healed up and just like that. 